hello again. A really nice afternoon after after a heavy rain, and but this is really nice. It pushed all the dust away. It was so damn hot in the last days, almost 40 degrees here. So now it was cooling down very very nice, and uh, we have uh, almost the end of the month. I have this uh, inverter installed in the last days of June so I may say now I have one month of, uh, of power with it all I have to say is that I'm really really pleased about the way this machine is working and uh, my install it's uh, very simple 950 watts hour of panels hey Tommy Look at this guy. What are you doing? Are you wet? Like a cat, of course. <laughs> so, um, all I have to say that uh, it's really working nice. Uh, it, I turned it off for the night. I'm using a Sonoff to do that, you know, to have all this schedule. And uh, I'll do some numbers, some compares about the statistics the Sonoff is recording for the production. Uh, in a month and uh, about how much uh, this guy is reporting you see what uh, what I got from Sonoff it's uh, 87.01 kilowatts for July that's not bad and the machine uh, it's reporting uh, 91.6 uh, kilowatts but if we consider that I install it in the last days of June, I have 8.44 kilowatts uh, production in June. So uh, with a simple deduction, I have a result of 83.16 kilowatts for July. And that's very close with the son of uh, history. There is a four kilowatts difference between uh, the reported data from uh, Sun GTIL and uh, Sonoff, but if we consider the consume for Sonoff itself, you know, four kilowatts or around like this, and the machine, you know, Sun itself, it's sometime consuming. So I may say that we can trust the history, the report, the Sonoff, it's, it's finally giving you at the end of the month. So far the numbers are pretty close and uh, it's nice to have an idea about how much uh, production you can have. I mean this is real life situation. This is nothing theory, you know, theoretical or you know all kind of uh, presumptions and stuff like this. It's very simple. 950 watts of panels at the right angle with the right cables and uh, there are the results and also some remarks I have a, another small panel uh, that's 100 watts panel you now it's working right now and this, that one is charging some batteries you know I have some night lights and some other stuffs uh, you know using like maybe 600 700 watts daily so I don't want to count them because the, there is no connection in between this one and the, the other install, you know. But anyway, if you take it the other way, it's a lot of power over there too. If you count like maybe 400 watts or 500 watts daily, that means at least 15 kilowatts per month. Okay, guys, thank you for watching. Be safe and hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.